My name is Nick Perkins. I live in Colombia and I'm mad about cycling. Join me and my Colombian friends as we explore the greatest cycling country in the world. I love cycling. I've been cycling all my life. And to me, Colombia has some of the best cycling I've ever done anywhere in the world. It's an absolute paradise. So what's this project all about? Well, I was fortunate enough to be able to get together with three friends, Alejandra in the Altiplano, Cundinamarca and Boyacá. One of the things that I love about being a cyclist in Bogota is that you can easily escape the city and you will find so many places to ride. Cesar in the coffee growing region. The coffee region is one of the few places in the world where you have the best of everything. Roads, gravel, mountain biking. And Mauricio in Antioquia, the land of eternal spring. So the region of Antioquia, especially around Medellin, is known for beautiful weather. And you'll also find very good smooth tarmac. I wanted to bring you along on a ride with me and three friends from three different areas of Colombia and let them show me the best that their backyards have to offer. So why do I think you should come and ride in Colombia? For me, what makes Colombia a really special place to ride is, first off, you can ride all year round. You've also got uh, temperature working as a function of altitude. If you want to ride like warm weather, just go down and uh, ride in amazing, warm, nice weather. You can be in cold weather in just a few kilometers away, start feeling the warmth of uh, lower altitude. Normally in here you, you could get away with using just a light jersey and a jacket for, for the descents, but most of the time you'll be enjoying beautiful weather. Of course, Colombia is defined by the Andes Mountains. In fact, Colombia is defined by having the three ranges which join in the south of the country to form the Andes Mountain Range. And uh, that's what makes Colombia quite a challenging country to ride. If you're not up for the challenge, yeah, you can go uh, in the valleys between the mountain ranges or in the lowlands, and you can find these vast expanses of, of green sugar cane with a slightly raised up road, uh, just running absolutely dead straight through the sugar cane fields. Here, you just go through coffee plantations, cattle farms. You're like part of the community now. People understand you as cyclists. They even cheer you on randomly. You sometimes feel like a rock star. It's, it's an experience. I've, I've never had it happen to me anywhere else in the world. And you will find an amazing gastronomy just a few miles away from Bogota. Food's amazing, and interestingly, there are specific types of food that they've become part of the Colombian cycling mythology. You sometimes even plan the ride around where you would like to stop and eat. To ride your bike in Colombia means that you will see the real Colombia. You can go anywhere and just feel welcome, feel safe. People are friendly. People will come up and just start talking to you and invite you to ride with them because they're curious about who you are and what you're doing here. For bicycle lovers, I mean, this is just like, this is a dream. Colombia has grown very strong cyclists. A lot of like professional riders they come down here for the training. So I really hope that this series of videos of me riding with my mates in their backyards gives you a, a down-to-earth perspective of, of what Colombia is as a cycling destination, of why you should come here. And we genuinely hope that we see you riding these roads with us sometime soon.